Hi all, I have a master account here that I'd like to share today. Um, the stats you can see on screen are overall stats for the account that has been running since October 23. Um, I've tagged on this account for many a cent account and for challenges, funded, etc. etc. I use this account as a test bed for strategies as well. Um, recently from this sort of peak onwards, it has been used as a test account to build data on strategies. In a little bit of drawdown at the minute on the account overall, due to a Euro USD reversal strategy, um, but one that I really want to show you, and a pair that might have caught some of you out of late, is Pound USD. Um, I've been running an RSI based strategy. On this account but with our reverse feature set to true so when we're in oversold territories we're still looking for sells and when we're in, when we're in overbrought territories we're still looking for buys and as you can see here's the stats for that strategy that's been running from April 23rd um, 2.5 percent gains that equates to around $1,500 of profit, a steady banker. Um, we have seen drawdown, but this is where we say take confidence from the data. If you go to drawdown stats, usually on um, MyFX book, they show in percentage. If you click this little set in here, you can see it in profit. And all that does is show you where the peak drawdowns have been on the strategy of which ours came on July 2nd at $900. Now this is trading small, 0.7 lots, 550 trade history. There's the monthly analytical data for that. And we've had a 900 drawdown as our max DD on the account. Now what this does now, that having seen the level of moves on pound USD that we have, I now know that this strategy can ride those moves out to that level. Um, I also get a feel for set files when we're running them in these market conditions. And this one in the main has been running well. I then the RSI has been triggering in the overbought or oversold territories. And then we're looking just to take our trades in those zones as and when the zones and the RSI level is met, resulting in that $1,500 profit with the one day being 957 in drawdown as the worst day, of which it then re reversed, the sequence reversed, and was able to close out. Going forward, I can take the strategy now and this data, and I can up the lots and start to use this maybe on cent accounts, or I could lower the lots and use it on smaller funded, not funded, personal accounts. I can take this now into funded accounts if I wish, knowing where my highest DD point was and adapt accordingly to the account size. Um, I've got a decision to make. I may run this on a Fixify 25k challenge that I've purchased. Um, this stats even running at four and a half percent daily loss of the allowed five percent allowance would still see me within the daily loss targets. I could potentially match this up with another set lower lot sizes find another set to run with it um, and to be fair I know it's been three months but I wouldn't actually be far off I would be well sorry not far off I'd be well into my target now of two and a half thousand that's required on a fixify um, but all this main part of this video is to show you that even when market conditions or pairs are going on hard in one direction you still can be taking profit if the set file's right. You need to diversify. There are other pound USD set files that I've used this month that I have hit EPs on, and they was all uh, reversal strategies looking to go against the trend. But this one has stood out as this one has rode out the pound USD moves very well. And I bid you all a farewell.